Oh my god, buzzer beater. We were... God, like, seconds away from getting a ting soon. <laughs> I don't know what I would have done, y'all. Whew! Okay, L allow me just a moment. I'm gonna turn on my fan even though it'll make noise. I hate having background noise, but my, like, little air purifier is already making noise. Some fresh air. I guess it's not really fresh. Some air. Some moving air. Hi, guys! It's almost Christmas, and it snuck up on me. <laughs> it's, Christmas is in six days, and I have, like, one gift for my family. So, I have a lot of work to do there. But, it's the holiday season. Ting, ding, tingle. However you celebrate the holidays, even if you don't, I hope you have a lovely December. End of December. Um, side effect of it being the end of December... School's out. I'm finally done with all my finals. All my my one final paper are all done. And I drove home yesterday with all my stuff. Set it all up. So this is my first stream since relocating my whole computer setup and microphone and everything. Uh, so there's a chance there will be some tech difficulties. So if the audio isn't quite right, if you hear like a, a lot of times after I move all my stuff... My, like, microphone cords are very finicky. If they're touching, like, any other cord, it'll make this, like, buzzing feedback noise. So if you hear a buzzing sound, please tell me. I'm going to stop talking for a second so you can tell me if you hear a buzzing. And I'm going to turn off the music. Buzz check. Ideally, you will just hear a very soft fan. No buzz. Amazing. Incredible. Okay. Um, I love streaming from my home my home home not my college home because I have a bigger desk a bigger room and I can scream plus the my walls are this are a dark color which I actually like for streaming because then I can focus on the screen more okay let me get some water you're so swag yeah it's the truth Okay. Um, we're playing Dave the Diver. We're playing Dave the Diver. Let me boot it up. Dave, Dave, Dave. I haven't uploaded in a while, and I don't have any uploads that are particularly close. So it's going to be a while until I upload again. And apologies for that. Um, also, I have this weird thing going on right now. I just texted my mom about it, and we're trying to figure out what it means. I'm, I, I hesitate to ask Google, because Google's always wrong about everything. And I'm sure if I send it, it'll be like, you have cancer. But I, I have this weird thing right now where the left side of my left hand has been, like, varying, varying degrees of numb for the last, like, two days. Like, specifically my pinky and ring finger, especially my pinky, and the left side of my, like, hand and palm has been numb. But, like, the kind of numb that you get if you have, like, pins and needles from, like, crossing your legs for a while or something and then your foot goes numb. I have that on my left hand right now as if there's, like, compression around my elbow or something. Um, and it's bothering me. It's been that way for, like, a couple of days. I had this weird thing where, like, my left temple was really tender to the touch and felt bruised for, like, five days and hurt whenever I would chew. But that just went away by itself. It's a carpal tunnel thing. You might have a nerve that's pinched. That was my guess. I, th I thought I figured, like, a pinched nerve or a blood vessel or something. Uh, that would be really funny. You lean on your elbows. I lean on my elbows a ton, especially with all the time I, I spent at the computer with my, like, left elbow anchored to my desk while I, like, game. <laughs> I think I got a gaming-related stress injury. That is humiliating. Okay, let me uh, set up the Dave the Diver capture here. That's <laughs> really funny. Dude, I got a fucking gaming injury. I'm so embarrassed. Rest in peace. Yeah, I don't have much time, I guess. Try using your wrist slash elbows and doing stretches. That's a good shout. But yeah, I very much lean on my elbow. And I, um... You gotta bring back the stack of nackets for support. Genuinely. Um, but yeah, I lean on my elbow a lot. And my, um... I do a lot of stuff with my... Like, I fidget with my hand. Like, especially recently, I've been putting my hands up to my face pretty much constantly. 
So it looks like I'm always like exhausted because I'm like rubbing my eyes or I have my hand like pressed to my temple. But in reality, that's just like some weird like, that's just how the way that my fidgety nature is manifesting these days is like, it's also because I've been having all these issues with peripheral vision. I'll just like black it out by putting my hand up to the side of my head, which is why I'm hesitant to do face cam because it would look like I was frustrated the whole time because I would have, I have my head in my hands like a lot of times while I'm streaming, but that's just like how I exist. Your second gaming injury. That's right. I busted that blood vessel playing Sonic Adventure 2. Speaking of Sonic Adventure, oh, we're going to get into the game eventually. Y'all, sorry. Sp speaking of Sonic Adventure 2, how freaking, I can't tell if this is a blessing or a, or, or a bummer because there's a chance it'll bring more eyes to my video. And there's also a chance, I think a higher chance, honestly, that it'll suck eyes away from my video. How obnoxious is it? That I uploaded my beating 100% of Sonic Adventure 2 video, what, three days before Alpha Rad released one? He has like 3 million subscribers. So now when you look up Sonic Adventure 2, my video is second fiddle to his video that came out three days later of him beating 100% of Sonic Adventure 2. I was like, the hell, dude? I've, I've never really watched any of Alpha Rad's videos. I know Sean really likes him. Um... But yeah, I was like, dude, what the hell? <laughs> it's so unfortunate. So now I, I, I'm losing out on search results, but there's a chance it'll also like reinvigorate the, the niche on YouTube and I'll get some love from that. But it's fine. Most recent comment on it is someone just saying, not watching this shit, which I love because you have to click on the video to <laughs> comment on it. Yeah. A lot of people don't like the title. I changed the title to Let's 100% the Worst Sonic Game for Shock Value because it's my it was my least favorite at the time. I guess I should amend that because I got more frustrated playing Sonic Heroes. So, maybe I should change that title. He's Jaden Animation's roommate. Oh, cool. Very cool. I used to watch her videos. I haven't watched them in a while. I don't say that because I'm like, oh, Jane Animations fell off. I just haven't watched in a while. Continue. Let's do it. Dude, my freaking hand is so annoying. My pinky is like completely numb. It's got like pins and needles. It's like, but it's not completely numb. It's like the kind of thing where it feels like full. I think there's like a pinched blood vessel or something because it feels like the way your foot does if you like cross your legs for a while. It's like as if I'm wearing a compression sleeve, but I'm not. I don't know. She's mainly a streamer now. Very cool. Bite your, bite your pinky like a carrot. I don't want to. Okay. Uh, I need to get the coral porridge to Ramo. Okay, we can do that. Uh, serve Marae curry and serve the food that Maki wants. Uh, I should be able to see my recipes, shouldn't I? Uh, weapon shop, what's happening? I don't want a small net gun. Oh, I could upgrade it. No, I can't. Why can I not? Oh, okay. I'm embarrassed. I just have to click on it. Uh, I need more fragments kind of across the board. Okay. So we're just going to continue grabbing anything we see. Uh, Cooksta, we're, we're, we're making our way to gold. We just need more followers. Our taste is immaculate. Uh, is there a way I can see my uh, recipes from my phone? Like my, my known recipes? Because I, I, I know that... that, that um... Here we go. Okay, hold on. Cooking. I also want to get better staff. So I feel like I should save up money to hire like a really good uh, employee. Um... Moray eel curry. I need two moray eels, which apparently I have to do by fishing at night. So that's cool. Massage your elbow. Maybe get a brace for it. Yeah, I'll investigate. And I, I remember the thing the thing that um, that girl asked for, I, d I don't know how to make yet. So it won't be in my list. Is there a way I can see all of them, even if I don't have it? Uh oh, I don't think so. Shoot, I don't. I, I'm not gonna have all the stuff she needs. Probably. 
Yeah. Okay. Uh, well... Yeah, Maki wants something that I, I don't recall. Okay, well, we're just gonna go do what we can. Look for fragments, get some fish to cook up, uh, deliver the, the porridge, and that's really it. We don't really have many ex explicit goals. I think we have some implicit goals. Especially with, um... Our, our, uh, eco-watcher stuff. Let's see. We need orange starfish. We need pink seashells. Uh, what is this? Agar? Something? Yeah. Uh, fossils. We need to kill the fried egg jellyfish. And we need to kill tr titan trigger fish and lionfish. Uh, well, there's one of those th the ones we need to kill. Bitch. 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 Okay, I don't need to waste my bullets. But this is wasting time. And both are valuable, so I'll just shoot them a lot. Okay. Ooh. The shock bang stick. Oh, wait. This could be an orange. Okay. Okay, that's three more of those killed. We'll make it happen. Don't you fret. So I think I just need to follow this again, don't I? This little uh, meter here, or this, this, uh... I forgot I have my control dash. Are those good? I don't remember if I like those or not. Oh, there's some fragments. Nice. And there's a Titan trigger fish we need to kill. And some ammo. Look at that. And some agar. Dude, holy shit. This is everything we could ever want. And some O2. Life is good. That's a normal starfish. I don't care. Stupid dumbass. Stupid. What up? Oh, and lionfish. This is like a dream. Yup. Yup. Happens. I know there's one more. You bet there is. No, you don't. Point blank. <laughs> okay, one more lionfish and some more trigger fish and we're squared. Shiner phone. Thank God, dude. I was starting to worry. You had me quaking. And my name's not even shoddy. A hand. Okay, well, that's all the foot... It was a foot. That's all the foot bones we need. Um, apparently, this thing is a quest item. I'm not sure why. I guess I should grab this if I'm doing upgrades. Gun upgrades now. I don't know what this thing's about. These rocks that, like, move around. Whatever. This is nice. I'm gonna keep my shock bang stick thing. Oh, wait, it actually is pretty good. 10 damage. Yeah, we're gonna do it. We're gonna go for the melee approach here. Um, some seashells. Some ammo. I'm not seeing any fish that I actually really want to capture. So, we're probably not going to be doing a lot of fishing today. I want that, though. Oh, I hit a rock. Gun. Hush dart. I'm good. It does give us higher grade fish, which is cool, but... I don't really care. <laughs> oh, no. I need that. No. Okay. Glam. I don't, I don't care. Okay. Why is, are all the seaweed things marked with, like, the quest symbol? Or what I think is the quest symbol. I don't, I don't understand. Okay, this thing needs to die immediately. Oh, I want those. 
I don't know what, what what does it mean when something's marked with the blue? I thought that meant it's a quest item, but I don't remember that being a quest item. I mean. No. Oh. Shoot me in my mouse. Um Yeah. What is happening? Whoa. Oops. I can grab them later. They'll stick around. Oh my god, that was close combat. Oh. I'm out of bullets. We did it. <laughs> Hooray! Baby sharks are called puppies. That's oh, that's awful cute. Okay. Uh, we got beat up a little, but that's fine. I have my O2 tank on deck. And they are again. Why are you, like, marked as special? It's a white Trevally, which I do want. Oh, we need this for the... I think we need this for the dish that the girl wants. It's all making sense now. It's all adding up. An old man pees into the wind. He says, it's all coming back to me. Metal. Those are pretty fish. I maybe, I'm sure there's some facet of the game that's like discovering all the fish and, and getting them all. So I feel like I should capture like any fish that I think might be new. In case it's like, I have to discover all the new ones. That was a pretty good shot. It got away. Come back. Why is this thing so evil? Okay, well, we got it. Uh, we already have that one. This one's new up here. That's fine. Oh, that's not. You're annoying. Oh, but there's Agar. Okay, we can fight. That's not Agar. It's this again. Oh, so this must also be needed for the recipe the girl wants. Okay. I'm understanding now. It took a while, but I'm there. I really do not want to deal with you. Oh, I don't want that. I have salt in it. I need salt from my signature dish. Okay, fine. We're gonna be ass. It's cat food. I keep getting that and then forgetting to feed it to the one cat in this game. Okay, I went the wrong way. We're doing great on oxygen, though, so all is well. We're going to be down here all night, and I really don't care. I have no issues with really taking my time on these missions. Another one. Now I've got my little scooter. I'm loaded, dude. Got an upgraded gun. Oh, I've, I'm like almost out of room. I guess it's those tiger shark heads. Pretty hefty. Go figure. All right, depths. It's very pretty down here. Oh, it's one of these things. It was a background. Don't worry, guys. It was just a background creature. Oh, and a starfish. Amazing. There's my flashlight. I want both of these things. I'll swap it for the capsule, and then I need to remember to come back and grab it. I want what's in here. Don't hurt me. There you go. Okay, now I can mine that amethyst or whatever. Okay, let's see if I can... Ah. 
It's dead. Okay. Now. I can mine amethyst. And I'm going to run out of room soon. I Next thing I want to upgrade is my, my carrying pack again. Because of everything, I think that's the thing I most like to be upgraded. Geese are nuts. Do not fuck with geese. Yeah, I can attest to that. Holy shit, they're mean. R. Okay, you know what? It got confused. Which is, like, fair. Okay. Ooh, claim. Amazing. Sea snake whip. The only whip I have is my... I think I'm, I made this exact joke last time. Please ignore me. Here, I brought some coral porridge. Oh, you really brought it. Seems to be right. This guy sucks. Ramo, this is coral porridge. Oops. Oh, I prepared it myself. No. Oh, no, she's fine. Yay! Whew, I feel much better now. I can't remember anything after seeing liquid tentacles. Huh? A human? What is a human doing here? I don't think liquid was correct. I think it was squid. Well, you could say I saved you. I defeated the giant squid and brought you the coral porridge. Mm, is that so? Wait, Ro Ramo, that's not it. I'm actually the one who... All right then, human. You shall escort me back to my village. Me? Why should I? I'm an injured lady. You need to keep anything dangerous from happening. Ramo, I can escort you to... Swamp! Go ahead and scout our path. What? How could you let a human escort you? I can keep you safe and... You haven't even passed the village tactics exam. It's rough enough coming here. Ugh, that's a sore spot for me. Swamp! Stop complaining and be our lookout for the path ahead. As for you, human, you'll have to carry me on your back. On my back? It's hard enough to move around as it is down here. Ow, my injured fin is hurting again. You're impossible. Take you to the village and no further, all right? God damn it. At least I at least she shut that guy down. He's a dick. Get to tar get to the target location safely with Ramo on your back. Ramo has the ability to open up two born paths. Watch your surroundings carefully and escort her safely. Okay, so can I like not fight back while I'm carrying her? Oh, and I can oh, I can let go of her for a second if I want to like defend myself. Okay, well, let me make sure I'm equipping the right stuff. Okay, I got my gun. And I got my uh, scooter. Because apparently I'm not going to need the, the UV light thing. Because she can just get rid of the two worms. Damn straight. Thanks, Chief. What is that bar? Is that a timer? Oh, it's probably just her health bar. Doi. Okay, where is... There you are. Oh, okay. Good. Follow along. Make sure Ramo isn't hurt. Yeah, okay, dude. Shut up. Yeah, I get the picture. They have a little too much sass for my tastes. I read that as a little too much ass. And I was like, I don't think anyone can have too much ass. Maybe that's just me. The more the better in my eyes. Oh, he's this way. I was wondering where his little symbol was. Oh, for shit's sake. Squid? What is this vibration? It's rare to experience one so strong. Did something happen to the village? We must return quick. Hurry, human. Just swim yourself, you bastard. Whatever. Uh-oh. Um, okay, we're gonna go around. Around. We're gonna go. Oh, crap. Those things are so scary. Okay, we're cool, right? Oh, I want those fragments. Here, wait. Can you wait here while I grab these fragments? <laughs> oh, I can see that being frustrated that the, that the button to aim your gun is the same as the button to pick her up. I can foresee an experience where I try to aim my gun at a predator and I accidentally pick her up. Okay, I don't want that. Just another... Just another crap. Here I am. Hey now, human. Don't tell me you're tired already. I'm fine. 
His his quads must be incredible with how much weight he's carrying in his backpack and with this this gal here. He must have just like toned quads. Oh, he's, he's this way. Okay, I see. What are you guys? It's a bomb. It's a bomb. It's a bomb. Okay, we're fine. That's what. I don't know how deep I can go safely. These things are beautiful and they don't hurt me, so I like them. I don't know how deep my suit can. Yeah, I'm. I'm. I'm leaving normal depth. Can't even go the right way. I don't even have like my little oxygen tank. Maybe I should have brought that instead of my scooter. Wait, I don't even, I don't need my freaking UV light. Why didn't I drop my, okay. Speaking of drop, you're gonna wait here while I see if there's oxygen tank in here. What the hell? Okay, well. Weep worm. Oh shit. Okay, let me, uh. Don't, please. Okay. Um, yeah, I might drown. <laughs> I might drown. I might drown down here. But I've come too far to give up now. Clam! My prayers are answered. We have to hurry. I, I would look in there to see if there's a, um, oxygen tank, but I might stop. My oxygen's draining fast. All right, critical depth. Ramo, this! Our path is blocked with rock! Well, shit. Okay, there's an emergency call. We're fine. What is going on? Oh, must have been the vibrations earlier. Swamp, think of something! Need to get back quick before my father scolds me even more. Um, mm, maybe we can open up a path by dropping the loose rock pile over there. If we can topple it and make it fall, it might just do the trick. Well, I suppose that might work. I didn't make the rocks fall, though. They're right there. I miss your stake over there. Maybe we can pull it out? I'll do it. I could probably do it with gloves that are thicker and offer a better grip. Dave, my apologies. I left the microphone on because I was dying to know what you're talking about. If it's advanced, oh, it's if it's enhanced diving gloves you need, I think my lab could help you out. Huh? New gloves? Oh, I could do urchins. Equipment goes in and in with exploration, does it not? Come over to the boat. Oh boy. I think there must be a way. Can you wait here for a moment? What oh, a human, you plan to leave Ramo in a dangerous place like this? Luckily, it's just me guarding her. Still, be back quick. <sighs> okay. Wait, I want to see if there's anything else I can grab. <laughs> I'm greedy at heart. Hello? Like this thing. Sorry. I didn't mean to. I meant to do this. I missed. I'm gonna get you, dude. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I got it. It's a salmon snailfish. Cool. More evil jellies. Oh, I'm sure there's tons of cool stuff over here. Nah, we're cool, right? We're cool. Ha ha ha! That was awesome. Oh my god! No! More oxygen. Wait, what's this? It's a pretty star. Clam. Okay, there's not really much to see here. I'm gonna kill this thing. That's gonna be the last thing I do. Idiot. Okay, cool. It's a cookie cutter shark. How cute. All right, off I go. I have more than my allotted weight. And I'm tired, so we're gonna leave. No, please. Oh, okay, we're fine. Oh, fragments. Can't believe I missed these. Yum. All right, now I'll save your friend. Because I can use my scooter. Yeah. 
Okay. Done. We still have only died, I think, once down here. So, pretty good. It's been a while, so knock on wood. But I'm proud of us. Dr. Bacon. What's up, my friend? Hmm, the road back to the Sea People Village, huh? How fascinating. My lab has developed some diving gloves. I thought I said dining gloves. To be used for retrieving artifacts. I see. That just let me pull out a stake without my hand slipping, right? <laughs> of course. We tested that exact scenario. It has various safety measures built in that'll let you move many other objects besides stakes, like urchins. The long dive must have been tiring. I was swallowed up. Get some rest. <laughs> I have to wait until tomorrow. So they just have to sit there for a full day. <gasps> I'm going to die. They have to sit there for a full day? Oops. Boncho approves. Okay, now I need the Marais eel still. So the food that Maki wants. Could I check in with the restaurant really fast? This doesn't lock me out of my afternoon diving window, right? I don't think so. Yeah, okay. We're literally fine. All right. Uh... Let's see, menu, who cares? Research, here we go. This is what Maki wants. It eases your stomach. White Trevally Kombu, o is it Ochazuke? I don't know. We're gonna research it, whatever it is. Okay, cool. Uh, staffing. We should put out, a, we should go ahead and put out an ad. I would like, yeah, much higher than, at a level much higher than current cooks are rating. This is good. Nice. Okay. So that's in progress. Um, dismiss. Oh, I can, I can, I can level, level her up. Um, to a level two Kyoko. Welcome to level two. You can, what is it? 215, oh my God, this is actually pretty cheap to get way higher skills. Uh, then she gets drink serving, she can serve drink. Oh, that's so helpful. That is really, really helpful. Let's do that. Nice. Okay, so Kyoko now has drink serving. What is her next thing? Just skill upgrades for 300. Okay, what about uh, what about James? Oh my god, of course. I'm just gonna blow all my money on training, dude. What's his next skill? Cooking plus, cooking ability increases permanently. Oh, so will their stats decay over time after you train? Yeah, dude. I've officially blown all my money, but now our stats are nuts. Okay, cool. Um, let's see here. Ingredients. Oh, wait. This is not what I wanted. Um, how do I check just my recipes in general? I guess I would go to uh, menu. Okay, I need... This is what I need. White Trevally. Okay, we have it. So, we're good to go. Um, that's That's sorted. So we just need to get the two moray eel meat for that other dude. Off I go. Let's go to the boat. There's like 60 mechanics in this game. Yeah, dude. So you own a restaurant or helping more people? Yeah, as well as a billion other things. <laughs> There's a lot going on in this one. Maybe time to upgrade your equipment? Shut up, dude. I have no money. I have no money. I can upgrade my weapon, though. I'm excited about that. Uh, upgrade. Here we go. I can get underwater rifle too, which is just a better rifle. Um, I kind of like it. I, I really do. It doesn't have any extra effects, but I, I like just the pure damage. I can shoot tigers and whatever. Tiger sharks. <laughs> I mean, I could shoot tigers. Let's do it. Oh my God. I was just making coffee. It was gunpowder, I'm embarrassed. Shit. We did it. And it's equipped. We did it.
Okay. And Eco Watcher, I finished something. Nice. Okay. Uh, still looking to kill Titan Triggerfish, Lionfish, and the Jellyfish, the Egg Jellyfish. Um, fossils, Agar, Pink Seashells, Orange Starfish. You know the drill. Okay. Let's move out. So not a lot of not a lot of uh, specific goals here in the, on this diving one. So we're just going to be looking for fish that we like and goods that we like. It'll probably be a quick trip. In and out in two flicks of a lamb's cheek. <laughs> two flicks of a lamb's giant blue hole. Take some more wood. Take some wood off your hands. I have my cool uh, gu gun, so I don't want a new gun. Don't even need to look at it. Stupid and dumb. I'll get these ones. Okay. Damn you! Um. Nice. Bitch! Oh. Why did it go downward? My mouse was not there. My mouse was not there. Okay. We got a couple fish. It's a good start. Oh, baseball bat? You bet. Play ball. Bing. Okay. Look at these tiny fish. Look at these tiny fish. They are real. They're so cute. They're so hard to procure. Okay, Titan trigger fish. More like Titan little bitch. Wow, I can kill it in one hit. Pretty awesome stuff. L shot. Okay, well, L thing to say to a friend. <laughs> Lionfish. I need to kill one of those. Pop. All right, done. Okay. Some wood. Can't get the urchin yet. We can get the rope. And the agar. Bing bong. All right, so that's another thing done. Agar is done. Lionfish is done. Very exciting. I watched Gab Smol Smolders play some of this game. She would never use the gun. It's funny watching Thermal light him up. <gasps> they give it to you, don't they? What am I supposed to do? Not shoot a bitch? <laughs> that was just for the love of the game. Okay, fossil. Anything but a foot would be ideal. First time I've ever said that. It's a head. No feet, we got head. <laughs> Pink seashell! Uh, is that the last one we need? No, we need a bunch. There's an elf for any boys me daily. It's not true. Making it up. Sword. Different play style is very funny. Definitely different. Bullis. Okay. I, it's been a while since I've found... I, I know there's a few fish that I really like. So I feel like I'll recognize them if I see them. That I like like to prepare for my customers. Like a very upgraded recipe. I keep finding the starfish that I don't need. Clam. Okay, nothing really going on down there. Okay, there's there's some spikes here at the end of this. Okay, we're good. Nice. La, 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 la. Guess we'll make more shark. Thirty-five, man. That is no joke. Oh, Trevally, I want those. Okay, we'll we'll come back for those. I don't want to waste all my bullets. Okay. That's stupid. We shouldn't use the bullets for the gun that we have. Okay. The problem with always getting shark meat is is how much of our of our backpack it takes up. But given, like, how little we actually really need down here today, I have no problem filling up on shark meat. Please, don't run away. They always run. Yay. I guess swim, you dumbass. La, 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 
My mom was coming home. You should just stop swearing and pretend you're a good influence. Okay. <laughs> I usually get comments like that all the time. Of people saying like, Hey, can you s stop swearing? My mom doesn't like when you swear. And I'm like, I, like, I, 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 there's no really, like, there's no way to say it without sounding like a douche, but I guess my, my target audience is a little older, so I've just never particularly believed in, like, and I, I have nothing against it. Like, it's not like I'm like, boo, people who don't swear in their YouTube videos. I just personally don't like censoring myself in any way. I, I like the idea of, of my YouTube videos just being an exact reflection of who I am. Turmeric. Family friendly? Absolutely not. Definitely less than we used to be. For a while, I was kind of censoring myself a little. And then at one point, I was like, I'm in this weird middle ground between like cursing but also censoring myself at the same time. I'm just going to go for it. Oxygen capsule. La 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 I'm having a hard time finding these fried egg jellyfish. We're back to when Thermo's like, I will never see the F word on this channel. That's right. For, it was it was weird. It was like I, I was fine with cursing in every way except the F word. I don't know why that was. But then I, I, I hit one point where I'm like, I mean, I'm cursing. Whatever. It's not like I'm trying to stay family friendly for like monetary reasons. Like, it's not going to limit my monetization. And clearly I care more about making videos in the style that I like than what best suits the algorithm, which is why I don't use face cam. Because I would technically make more money if I used face cam, but I don't like it. Honestly, we're, we're pretty much good. I think I think we just call it. We got fish. We, we found some stuff. There's not really anything we need to do down here right now. Sonic would make a nun swear. Yeah, exactly. Sonic was was the was what opened the floodgates. La da. La da da da. Nice. Thanks, Poncho. Uh, wrap up your day and get things ready at Poncho Sushi. Okay, well, I need to find some... Um, you only dive once at night. One third of evening working hours will be consumed. Yeah, I'll do it. Okay, so that means we're going to get two thirds of the orders we usually do. Which means I should prepare less dishes tonight. This is my first time night diving. And it's beautiful and I love it. I forgot to do my eco watcher. I forgot I needed to turn in my eco watcher shit before coming down here. Damn it! So I could go ahead and get started on my other agar stuff. Now I'm embarrassed. Well, that's fine. Look at all that agar that I just wasted. I'm such a freaking. Oh my god! I'm so stupid. I'm so stupid. Okay, I'm looking for two moray eels. I hate when content creators use face cams after they've been without them for a while already. You're like, I don't care. You can do whatever you want. I'm just not very comfortable putting my face in a video, so I won't. Well, I am. I'm not comfortable doing it on a live stream. Because it's not like an issue with like, I don't like the way I look. Or like, I don't like people knowing what I look like. Those are whatever. I just don't like knowing during a live stream people can see me. Because I, I don't know, I put my hand, head in my hands all the time. And then when people comment on it, I get self-conscious about it. Shark. I. You're not an eel. You're not a moray eel. So I really don't care. Oh, I just cornered myself. Okay, I need you to dash at me right here. Okay. Here we go. Or just swim past me, I guess. <laughs> don't touch me. Okay. Um, I don't know where these eels are, but we need two of them. He picking his nose? He'd he not be picking his nose. He'd be rubbing his nose all the time. And he'd be messing with his face. Often.
I love when they do it occasionally, though, because it's like a little treat. Yeah, I mean, I'll do it sometimes. Also, there was just one, one time where I did face cam during a stream. And there are a bunch of times where I, like, kind of, like, zone out and my face kind of goes neutral. Most people are like, what's wrong with him? And I'm like, okay, I'm never doing this again. This is, like, <laughs> one-way ticket to insecurity in, like, every every way. What does a moray eel look like? I don't know. These assholes are all on my tail, and none of them are moray eels. I feel like I'll know, because it's an eel. Big eel. Yeah, that's what I figured. <laughs> I, I probably just haven't run into one yet. Well, it's good to know I don't really have, like, a real-time timer. It's just, like, just by being down here, you've lost some time, but that's it. Okay, I just need the tibia. I don't need the foot or the head. Oh, my God. Incredible. Okay, just one more of those. That was really lucky. Whoa, another big-ass shark. You know the drill. Excuse me, bitch. Uh, paging bitch. There you go. I will unload a clip into this dude without batting an eye. That's the kind of diver I am. <sighs> Please die. Oh my god, how am I out of stuff? Usually that's plenty. Is this like a different kind of... Oh no. Oh, I need to get that tank. Oh, no. He's getting aggressive, and I can't... Hurry. Oh! That was a huge play. Okay, well, now I, I just have to use melee? Are you kidding me? Okay, hold on. Hold on, hold on. Maybe I can go reload and then come back. That's a, that's a big find as well. Are there any bullets nearby? Keep my eye on you. Okay, there's another there's another gun thing, so I can I can get a refresher. Ah, hush dart. It doesn't even do damage. That's literally the one kind of gun that is not helpful. That's really unfortunate. I was looking at chat fully. I that was really fortunate that I didn't just die. I I want to kill that thing, but I'm out of bullets, and there are none. And I got the, I, that was incredibly unlucky. Okay, there we go. It's very unlucky that I got the one type of gun that doesn't deal damage. I hope it doesn't despawn. Alright, we have eight more shots. Tar shark? That That's a bigger shark. That might not be a tiger shark. It might be a great white. If that thing can hurt me. It doesn't even have like a your evil symbol. Okay, well, I'm gonna hydrate. It is a tiger shark. It was just extra mean for whatever reason. Why? You guys are such little dicks. Okay, I need a moray eel. And it doesn't have to be high quality. I'm fine killing it because I just need to prepare the dish to finish the quest. That's just a bull. Oh my god. If this is a leg bone, I'm going to freak out. Okay, that's fair. Can't expect to get that twice in a row. Um, What the hell, man? Tan and long eel therm. Thank you. <laughs> I can't find one. Oxygen tank. Give one more bullet. Hello? Ooh, scooter. Extremely appreciated. Okay, it doesn't let me go down there. Um, lots of oxygen tanks.
Oh, no, but that, that gun's way better. It does more damage. <laughs> and has five more bullets. They live in little rocky caves and coral. I don't know where they would be in the game. Well, I feel like I'm in the spot. What in tarnation? Where are these damn eels? I have like infinite time down here. I don't care how long it takes. This doesn't track real time. Just by coming down here, I already have a sunk cost. I might as well make the most of it. Look at that. Those are the econ shops that probably failed my final. This looks like it wants me to keep going. Okay. <laughs> Fine. Where are these damn eels? Up your butt? Shut up. Shut up. We both know that there's not a moray eel in my butt. They're scared of me. Did you see that? They're starting to fear me. Word's getting around. This new guy in town totally fucked up that shark over there, y'all. You better watch it. Oh, God, please. Right. Not yet. <laughs> I don't like how foreboding that is. This song is very relaxing. A fragment. Yes, Papa. Frag out. Miso. I'm not making a stupid joke. There's always an urge to make a stupid joke when I read the word miso. There, there's no need. Oh, a lionfish. I've already killed enough of them, so we're, we're all good. Um, a bowl. Another scoot. In real life, they don't live very deep. I figure there might be a chance it would be more shallow. They're literally everywhere. There are evildoers everywhere. <laughs> Earned. Oh my god, I got an achievement, Mr. Melee. Thanks. I got an orange starfish. Life is good. Oh, it's a different kind of shark. Um, eel. Oh, oh! It's not yellow in this game, but it's, but there's an eel. Excuse me. Sorry. Pardon? Okay, we got it. Eel. And I need two of them. Well, maybe one eel makes two cuts of meat. It makes three cuts of meat. It said zero out of two, and I can't tell if that means I need two eels or if I need two bits of eel meat. My guess is the latter, so we should be good to go. But I'm inclined to stay here and look for one more eel um, to be safe. All right, we found an eel, y'all. He looked dirty. He looked dirty. Shut up. Back! Back! Yes. Fragment. Give me that O2, baby. I deserve it. Hello? Okay. Yippee! Okay. Um, one more eel I think we should do just to be safe. I think. Yay! Okay. Father, son, and the Holy Spirit. I don't care about the quality of the meat. Whoa! You want smoke? I will kill all of you. I'll tank the hits. You do no damage. Sorry. Sorry that you wanted to throw hands. It's not my fault.
Or that whole family. Well, they shouldn't have crossed, is all I've got to say. Boncho loved it, so. Okay. Let's go now. We need one serving of Murray Curry, one serving of the Trevally, whatever. Um, white Trevally, just the one. Um, Murray Eel Curry, just the one. And those are reserved. Okay, and now we can start dishing for real. Tiger's Shark Sushi. This is level five. We have so much tiger shark meat. We should probably upgrade this some more. Wow. Okay. Let's do like seven of those. Awesome sauce. And then we also have the uh, salt grilled red tooth trigger fish, which people think is tasty. enhance that but it's fine uh we probably already have enough stuff do one of two two of these just in case okay we, we're probably squared away because we already lost uh a third of our work time so yeah we've got our staffers i think we're good to go all right let's move babies hey man There you go. She's pouring drinks. What do we think, dude? Now please leave. Oh man. He's a child again. All right, now pay up. I can't move. Oh, okay. That's the taste I remember. I'm glad you like it. The food brings back memories. One time a young man who lived with, I don't care. Lived with a sick mother in my village, was bitten by a moray eel, keeping them from going into the sea any longer. I was 12 then, and I went out into the pitch black darkness and plunged a harpoon into that moray eel's gills. I brought them the dead moray eel, and the mother made me moray curry and thanks. Thinking of that woman's kind eyes brings tears to my eyes. In any case, thanks for food. That was some fantastic cooking. No sweats. Now I, I need to... Oh, what's happening? Come see me in the empty lot behind this building. You bet! <laughs> Otto's gift? Uh, I don't know about that. Perfect. You bet. Oh my god. There's a huge backup. There's a huge backup. Hurry! Oh my god. Oh my god. You're so far away. Okay. It's what you wanted. It's exactly what you wanted. Amazing. Hang in there, monkey. <laughs> Why are you crying suddenly? It's too good, you, I don't know, bastard. This is way too good. Damn it, it's too good. It reminds me of my father. Uh, what's going on? My name is Maki. I'm looking for, oh. My name is Maki. I'm looking for my father. My father left to explore the depths, and I can't get in touch with him anymore. His favorite food was kombu and white trevally ochazuke. I heard you sell it here. I thought he might have come by here. That's a pity. Maybe it's Otto. I'll be sure to tell you if we see someone that looks like your father. And what is that doll? This is a Cleone plushie. My father gave it to me before he left. Oh, I have a favor to ask. It's about the Cleone. I've never seen one in person. Could you catch one for me? Huh, Cleone? Maybe it's Cleone. Uh, we can't catch something so small with a harpoon. What do we do? Can we use this? Oh, a bug net? Hmm, I think it might work. All right, I'll give it a shot. What are you doing, you walrus? Get your thighs on and jump in the water, tights. Tights. Oh, I'm so sorry. I can't control my emotions that well yet. Okay, back to work. New content. I love content. Oh my god, please let me play. People are people are wanting food. Okay, she's on it. Yeah, she'll she'll serve that up. 
I got I got clean. Done. Flawless. Flawless. <coughs> Good day. Five stars. Another perfect day. Perfect score. Another perfect score. Nice. It's raining today. It's our first rainy day. And Otto's calling. Did you sleep well? Oh, okay. Yesterday I told you I'd tell you something good. <laughs> Take the boat and come behind the restaurant. Hmm. Sure. <laughs> okay, wait. Let me check my phone. Oh, it won't let me. Okay. It will not allow me to do anything else. All right. We're going behind the restaurant. It's a new mechanic? Farming? This game has so many mechanics. Wow, what is this place? Oh my god. Looks like you're doing quite a lot of hard work catching fish every day. So I got into making a fish farm and finished it a single day yesterday. In a single day, sorry. <laughs> Having trouble. What a single day? In any case, this is where you can grow fish. Let them multiply. I'll explain slowly, so listen closely. First, come over to the first section. Oh, fucking really? This is so much. Look at me. This is like a different video game. Fish farms need to have the right environments for the fish. Each section has fish from a different depth. This is where you can grow fish that lives at depths of 0 to 50 meters. Each section has limited space, and once the density reaches 100%, no more fish can fit. <laughs> of course, you can pay a bit of money to expand them. <laughs> Each section is equipped with its own camera, so you can look inside. Now, come along. Mm. Okay, look at them all. So cute. Nice, isn't it? Added a few fish to start you off. Wow, it's like an aquarium. Just staring into the water is enough to make you all peaceful inside. But that isn't the purpose of the fish farm, of course. I'll teach you how to pluck them out so they can be eaten. Pay attention. Select. Fish in the fish farm can be sent to Pancho Sushi to be used as ingredients or sold directly. <laughs> Even if you fail to catch fish because you're so busy exploring, you won't need to worry. Oh my god. This is so exhausting. Why, like, there's too much. How do we add fish to the farm? Simply catching them will kill them. Good question. You can farm them by collecting fish eggs. If you capture some fish alive, you'll sometimes get fish eggs. Those eggs will automatically be sent here. Oh, one more thing. If you have two or more of the same type, they can multiply. Wow, I see. I've, faced, I've placed two fish each. So you should be able to see the results tomorrow. Try coming back tomorrow. Okay. When catching fish, the swimmers acquire fish eggs. These can be hatched at the fish farm. If hunting isn't a viable option, try getting ingredients from the fish farm. <laughs> did I just scratch my ass? I think I did. Okay. Um. Oh. Okay. Sorry. I was just curious. Okay. I need to collect five Cleones. Why do I need five? All right. Well, off I go. I guess boat <laughs> they fucking I mean clearly my gloves these are special diving gloves made in our research facility with these will be able to pick up various objects in the water why don't you test them out yourself enter the water no don't tell me don't tell me what to do uh not yet no I want to look at my phone dude Whatever. Yeah, I can pick up shit now, I know. Oh, look, there's there's wood blocking that thing down there. Objects that can be picked up will show a button you go near them. Try grabbing the pile of rocks over there and dropping them. It's weak wood, so you should be able to break through. Oh, 
Oh, I gotta. Nice. Wow, very nice. Let's try going down. Okay. La 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 Ah! The current strong. Grab that anchor so we'll sweep you away. Oh, that's cool. You grab onto objects like that anchor, or like that to anchor yourself. Very cool. Okay, move oh. to the stake. Something shiny back there. There's so much to remember in this game, dude. Awesome! Since the path is open, got the treasure there before coming up. It's a bowl. Alright, see you on the boat. Soup bowl. Hello. Yay! Did it. Looks like Dr. Bacon left abruptly again after finishing his exploration. Explanation. Please excuse me. In any case, these diving gloves, they could come very handy. But the sea people are waiting for it. Yeah, afraid so. Okay, I need to, uh, need to go back down to them. Ugh. Let's see if I can upgrade my suit because I'm, I need to be able to dive deeper. Uh, yeah, depth limit. A thousand? Oh, but I, I need money to like hire people. We can handle it. We handled it last time. We can handle it. And if we can't, whatever. There's not that much stuff I really need, so it's not dire. We have lots of ingredients for sushi back at the restaurant. Oh, I forgot to do my eco-watcher shit again. What is wrong with me? All right, well. Off we go. Gun box. Ah, oh, huge. Those enhancement kits are awesome. Okay, we'll gather some little fish just in case we can't find enough to serve the, the masses. La, 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 la. Okay, I don't know what a Cleon looks like, but I'm assuming it'll flag it for me if I need it. I also don't know where my bug net is. It's a, like, I don't know if I have to have it equipped or if it's just something that I have on me forever now. I hope it's the latter. But, uh, don't. You guys are so annoying, it's insane. Batter up, batter up. Okay. Nice. Black vinegar. Mackerel scad. Uh huh. Okay, leg bone would be nuts here. That would finish another thing off. Ah, it's a foot. It's a foot bone. Pink seashell though. One more, and, and that's another thing checked off. What about down here? Give me a little accessory. I'm still very pleased with this. Okay. What is that? It's a brown seashell. Uh, okay. Um, I'd like to go up there. Thanks. Another upgrade kit would be nuts. Enhanced harpoon tip. Very helpful. So even if we have a gun that we're happy with, we should still check all the gun boxes. In case they have like some kind of upgrade in them. I haven't been doing a good job of that. Alright, replenish some O2. The sea people can wait, honestly. I don't care. Okay. I should have thought that through. Alrighty. 
What is, uh, what do we need? We need to go to the access road. We need to catch the five Cleones. I don't know where these things are, but we need five of them. Okay, let's kill another shark. I mean, why not, right? It's worth a lot of kashish. Oh, I gotta do a, this freaking thing. You're gonna waste bullets on this thing. Okay, it, it gave up. Dude, easiest thing I've ever done in my life. We really just picked our specialty here with the shark meat. I don't know if this is smart what I'm doing of just serving my customers shark every damn night. I don't know if that's not smart, but it's what I'm doing. Oh, some, some Trevally. I would like some of those. I haven't had cereal in forever. I literally have cereal every morning. Like, no... I have no variety in my breakfast. Every morning, the first thing I eat when I wake up is a bowl of cereal. For the past, like, three years. That's not true. There was a bit where I was eating toast and applesauce. <laughs> now it's just cereal and one extra little thing. Whether that be, like, a, a little pastry or an applesauce pouch or something. Not finding any Cleones. What is this? Oh, I can catch it. Ah! I can catch the really little things now. I got a dwarf seahorse. I don't know what a Cleone looks like, but I need five of them, apparently. I'm almost out of room. Oh, it's probably all those dead freaking... Okay, hold on. Um, let's sort by weight. Yeah, Titan Trigger Fish. Discard. 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 Okay. Uh, pff. doesn't really do much for me, does it? <laughs> it's mostly just the shark meat and the trevally. That's fine. We've got all the fish we need. Now I'm just kind of looking. I just need to get back to the depths, and I'm looking for some Cleones or whatever. Okay. Let's just go. Let's just go do this task. If we find a clean on our way, we grab it. In the event that we don't, the very likely event that we don't, that's fine. It's no big deal. I'm gonna top off my oxygen tank before I go down. Cause why not? My throat's scratchier after doing that voice. I'm not fit for that. I don't do that voice very often that I was doing for that little boy. Is that Cleon? It's a chamber Nautilus. Still very cool. And cute. Oh my god! 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 Okay, this is what I need. Oh, it's the little, like, butterfly fish that I saw the other... Yeah! Okay, there's one. I need five of them. Which is a lot, let me just say. Here's another one. You're not getting away. Okay, um... There's two... I thought you just said, give me a Cleon. Why, why, why do I need, like, a, a, gr a Grillion? These things are annoying. I want to see if there's any Cleons over here. It's a no, so I'm going to I'm gonna leave. Come on, three more. <laughs> I enjoy streaming here so much more than streaming at school for some reason. I just feel so much more comfortable. I really love it. And that's where the conversation can end. I swear to God, I'm just waiting for a message to pop up of like, as a psychology major, the reason you're feeling this is because no, no, no. Let me keep my whimsy. Oh, can I drop a rock on this bastard? Can I do that? Yes. Oh my god. That was awesome. Uh, okay. Let's just leave. I think we got... There's no more Cleonage up here, right? Yeah, we're fine.
Oh my god. Whatever. I feel like of all majors, I don't think there are any majors that I more consistently hear as a blank major than psychology. I swear to God. Like, I know it's because it's very applicable in the real world, but it's like every time some kid does that in one of my classes or something, it's like, how do I tell this person that I truly could not care less that they're a psychology major? Like, how do I tell you that? Rubber chicken. Well, that was a good time. Another, oh, shark, shock harpoon tip. Very cool. Uh, okay. Rocks. Pile of rocks is moving around. Oh, I want that fragment. Oh, it's this damn octopus again. Hi, friend. Oh, I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you. I'm gonna get you, friend. Literally just tell them you don't care. Well, in like a class, I can't, like it's quiet class, but I can't do that. In the real world, I will do that. I'll be like, mm, I don't care. Oh, I need to do it again. I hear as an English major goes to grammar a lot. Yeah. Done. Okay, wait. Let me let me check what's in here. Okay, I'm good. Let me top off my O2 and then I'm going down. Nice. Some little little bee. Hey, how dare you spray ink twice? Won't let you get away with this. Ask Boncho for takoyaki. Oh. Oh, it left me something again. Wow. Got another prize. You know, he's leasing behind. Maybe it's not as bad as I thought. Yeah, clearly. Yay. Artifact acquired. Okay, I'm gonna see if there's any Cleones in here. No. All right. Fine, forget it. Critical depth. Uh oh. Okay, I'm gonna stay a little high. I'm back, guys. I'm back. It took me a day. It took me a day. I skipped your dialogue because I truly don't care. All right, pull out the stakes. Yes, sir. Yeah. I did it. Boom. It worked. It was effective, but not enough. Mm. I think one more attempt might cut it. Okay, well, that was kind of a one and done deal. Human! There's another rock pile over there. Oh, I gotta I gotta go um gotta go around. I have to check it out, really. I can immediately tell other oh, stakes on the other side. Uh. Yeah, he's gonna be like, but, but. All right, well, I gotta go around, so I'll be a bit. You guys just hang tight. You already stuck around for a day, so just keep doing that, I guess. Nice. 
Ammunition. Okay, I'm already full. Uh, no Cleones around, I see. Here we go. Dope. Dopeness and epicness. Oh, I can use my pickaxe. Grab some opal ore. Yes, sir. It made a little beep, which means it might be important. Is it like an upgraded thing? Oh, it's a flame. I forgot you can disassemble guns. I've been leaving them behind. The guns I don't want, instead of disassembling them. Yeah, that's way smarter. Why am I not doing that? Well, now I'm embarrassed. I literally... Okay. I literally forgot that was a mechanic. I'm also very low on oxygen. I'm starting to worry. A little bit. Please have an O2 tank. Please. Ugh. You shouldn't have. There we go. Very, very handy. And a leg bone would make today just the perfect day. Okay, might be a while until we get this last leg bone. Nice shot, dumbass. There we go. It lived. Okay, we're just gonna scoot around it. Uh, oh, that's where I need to be. Is this a sea people building? The door is locked. Oh my god. I would like to investigate, but there are little assholes around me at all times. There we go. Okay. Um, I can't break down the door. Okay, well, that's not what I wanted to happen. All right. Um, oh, these can be used for upgrades. <laughs> Damn, do I have to go all the way back and tell them like it's locked? Now I'm encumbered again. Oh my god. Okay, let's go up. Just in case. I don't know. Maybe there's something up here. It's like a no, y'all. Oh, I definitely need a, a refresher on, on my ammo. Nice. Okay, you can come at me and then it, it'll be fine. Cool. Um. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. No way they're gonna make me go all the way back. I wanna make sure it okay. I wanna make sure I know what's up here before I throw in the towel. Please. Don't hurt me. Okay. Nothing. The answer is nothing. So Yeah. Um. Whoa, it's a giant oarfish. Oh my god. Giant oarfish. Optional goal is blue plankton. Oh my god. Incredible. I did it. Okay. That's really pretty. Um. Damn, y'all. Huh. They might make me go all the way back. I, I'm sorry to say, but I, I think it might be the truth. I fear that it is the case. Pink seashell. That's the last one we needed. I might have to, uh, 
see we went. Is this the locked door? Yeah. We might have to go back and talk to them. Let's do it. It won't take too long, probably. It'll take a little while, <laughs> unfortunately. But that's fine. Please. Okay. Shoot, I don't remember how to get down there. Okay, here we go. So fast. Look at how fast I am. Look at how ding ding fast I am. Such a fast little boy. So I'm just be beeped. Oh, it was my flashlight charging back to full, I think. Okay. Um, y'all, your door is shut and I don't know what to do. Help. Get the path open. Really? Nothing? Ugh. It says check out the rock pile. It says that's still unchecked. But I did. Uh-oh. Is this the first, like, quest we have that's gonna require me to actually, like, think critically? Oh, no. Okay, we're fine. And I've got clam as well. There's a little tube up there. I'd leave their ass. Yeah, same. I wish I could. I wish I could right now. I don't know. What the hell? Okay, well, I'm going to go down this way again. And I'm going to see what's up. Yeah, it's just the same thing. Huh, man. Yeah, nothing here. We're not at critical depth still. Here it is again. I just need to get on the other side, but I'm not sure, like... It, it looks like the entrance is from the from the left side. So it feels like I should be able to... Access it from over here. Just trying to see if there's, like, a little hidden path in the ceiling. Okay, well, let's get our clam. Let's get our clam. Let's stop messing around and just, just grab a clam. There we go. Let's clam up. Uh, I, I need K team. I'm trying to K. And I D. I'm really hungry. Even though I just ate before this. So I'm going to go down. some veggie straws. Veggie straws were, were, were the go to stream snack for a really long while, and then I kind of fell off. And now I'm back on the train. <laughs> Favorite veggie straw color. Orange, I think. They taste the best. Not orange. Well, this is crazy. I said orange. 
and then someone said not orange and then the very next two messages are I fuck with those green ones followed by anything but green tbh that is crazy let me check twitter for baseball news It's always the food discourse that tears the community to shred. Just the one. Sorry, I'm not really doing much. I'm just really enjoying my veggie straws. <laughs> like more than I expected. Wow, wow. Okay. Let's get back to work. Where was I coming from? Was I coming from this tube? I can't remember if I just came this way or if this is where I need to be. I forgot. It's literally right there. Okay. Well. There's a stake in the back. If I pull that out. Pull out, Dave. Alright, let's see. Off I go. Perfect. Bingo! See, sometimes taking a break is all you need. I did it. I did it. You're more useful than you look. Shut up, bitch. Phil, just very close. I can lean now, can't I? Well, would you listen to yourself? Aren't you worried for Rama? Besides, I have a request for you, so I'd like you to come to the village with us. Oh my god. Yes, there's a reason I came all the way up to the human sea. I have a request. Oh, okay. Dave, you are such a friendly dude. I would say no. I would say no. I'm gonna die, dude. I can't go that deep. I might need to upgrade my suit before I can do this quest. Let's see if there's an oxygen um, tank in here. No. That'll help, though. Please be quick. Ugh, I'm getting real spooky vibes. Oh my god. Uh oh. It's got a highlighter tail. Something just moved past me, do you think? Human, go ahead and be our lookout. But it's so dark. It's like there might be something dangerous there. Ugh. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm at critical depth. Once entering the event, we'll proceed. I'm going to return to the boat. I'm going to die immediately. I don't have any... All right. I don't care if I lose my stuff. I'm not that invested in any of the stuff I'm, I've got on me right now. Oh, God. Okay. There's anchors.
I'm gonna be so proud of myself if I can handle this fight with the critical depth thing. I only have like three seconds left to live. Uh oh. Here we go. Boss fight. It's the wolf eel. Pick an animal. Oh, whatever. Uh. Eh. Okay, I gotta be up high. Where are you? Is that what Oh, God. gonna go across this oh okay it's not draining my my health anymore from being deep looks really tough that's not why it's tail looks bigger than the rest of its body I figured okay cool I don't have very many bullets unfortunately oh what the hell I forgot the controls okay it doesn't matter Okay, I'm gonna save my bullets. I only have two bullets. Which isn't great. Oh. There's an O2 tank and there's bullets. And there's this gun box. And there's another O2 tank. It's a triple axle. I guess I'll go ahead and use one of them. Oh shit, I wasted that. Oh. <laughs> he turned white. I whitewashed him. It, was that literally it? There's no way. That was way too easy. That was it. Wow. That was really easy. Okay. How can a wolf yell be so big? <clears throat> I was just about to come and defeat it. Guess I came too late. Uh, you're stronger than I expected, human. Now, you see that big gate over there? That's the entrance to the village. Take the lead, human. Okay. Can I go get my... Uh, but this, they're gone. All right. Bing bong. Wolf eel tail meat. I'm encumbered. All right, that's fine. Investigate the sea people gate. I will do that. Could not find any more Cleones, but that's fine. I'm gonna keep eating veggie straws. Ta-da! Hooray! They're gonna take me to their village. It's so bright. It's so bright. It's so bright. Okay. It's the Sea People Village. It is very pretty. Wow. So this is... <laughs> that is right. This is the Sea People Village we live in. I think there would be a place like this under the sea. Yeah, man. Whoa. Oh, Wang. Calm down. Wait. How, how did a human get in here? Huh? Ramo and Suam... Were you kidnapped by this human? Tenzin awaits you. He's lost sleep worrying about you. Um, it's kind of hard to explain. <laughs> Allow me. I rescued Ramo after she was kidnapped by a squid. Forget it. Just take me to my father. It'll be faster for me to explain things to him. Yay! Whoop. Screen, screenshot. I made it to Tenzin's house. Tenjin? I don't know if the ZH is pronounced like a Z or like a Z. Oh, he's so happy. She's not. Oh my goodness, Ramo, my daughter. Where were you, my precious girl? Your daddy, your daddy was worried out of his wits. Are you hurt? Did the humans do something to you, my daughter? 
Wait, who is this next to you? I thought you'd brought a blue manatee, but this is a human. Dude, everyone in this world is so mean to Dave. What is going on here? I'd like an explanation. You know that strange things have been happening around here recently, right? For example, the tremors and the ice melting off the divine tree. Of course, Ramo, been looking into the causes. It's already been two years. You know our technology has its limits. Well, the ancient texts have all been lost. We need to figure out new methods again. We can't simply keep waiting, Father. Humans are selfish, but they have good technology. <laughs> we need their help. No, not the humans. They can't be trusted. They dirtied our home and even hunted our kind to put on display. They're wicked creatures looking to hunt us and steal from us. Yeah, true. We can't ally with the likes of... Dave. Uh-oh. Oh, you're screaming. <gasps> uh, another huge tremor. See? Something really bad will happen if we don't do anything. Um. Hmm. When I was taken by the giant squid in human waters, Dave here helped me out. Swam said he was the one who did that earlier. Try asking him. Not all humans can be bad, can they? I mean, well... Even if I wanted this, the villagers would not agree. Getting help from humans? Everyone would find that hard to believe. If this man can gain the village's trust, I'll consider your suggestion. Easy. Easy. How about asking around to see what they need? Alright. Since today's long trip must have been pretty tiring. Human, come back here tomorrow. You will listen to the villagers' requests. Okay, whatever. Whatever. That's fine. I need to upgrade my suit, I guess. I am gonna eat some extra trust. Thanks, ma'am. Super helpful. Looks like an ordinary mirror. This sea people mirror, once installed, will let you instantly travel to this village. Oh, so helpful. So helpful. Right now, all we have left is a few of their relics, sadly. Thank the Lord. In any case, installing this in your village will allow you to come to this village whenever you need. It will recognize your face. Only you will be able to use it. It also operates from the light of the divine tree or the sun. So you can only use it during the day. Oh, and I'll give you the village map to use. Help you find the villagers. Hooray! I did it. I did it. Yay. Look at all these goodies. Oh yeah, and, and the octopus relic. It's an octopus weapon charm. A mysterious weapon charm left behind by the octopus. Oh, more gun damage. Yeah. What up, dude? Oh, I got the picture. That's right. A, a giant ore fish. I heard the fish was referred to as a god in the ancient times. Really is huge. Amazing. How long is it going to be until he goes like, ooh? Okay, he didn't do it. Never mind, there it is. There are photo spots all over the place. Thank you for your help and keep up the good work. Thanks, man. <laughs> oh, fish love. Grab up your day and get things ready at Pancho Sushi. We got applicants. Baller. Uh, okay, install the mirror. Oh my god, there's a lot going on. I'm back. It's gonna arrive too late. Just do a little cleanup. Kit Kat. Hi. Huh? Miss Yoshi, what are you doing here? Oh, my work ended just now and I was passing by. So the lights were on despite the hour. Boncho seems to have gone home already. I looked a bit tired recently. I'm worried he might fall ill. <laughs> Even so, I'm glad to see him working so hard again like this. Oh, come to think of it, I heard he once gave up on cooking because of a certain incident. What happened? 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 Can you first give me a glass of beer? Yes. Yes. Pour so that about 20% is foam. Good. I think I need to pour more. Nothing so refreshing as a glass of beer after work. 
Especially nice to have a view of the sea at night like this. <laughs> oh boy. It's especially nice to have a view of the sea at night like this. As I dr like this. How do you say that in a normal way? Nice to have a view of the sea at night like this as I drink. It's too many prepositional phrases. It's like there's no way to say that naturally. That's, that's the one thing about this game that I've noticed. I'm not sure if maybe it was translated or what. I can't tell if either the dialogue here was written in a different language than the translated or if it's just a bit clunky. But some of the dialogue feels a little bit clunky sometimes. It's like my one gripe about this game. Other than that, I'm loving it. I'll tell you now a bit about Boncho and why he quit cooking for a while. It was 12 years ago. Okay. I was eight years old. I'm gonna eat veggie straws while we get while we get our uh, exposition here. Now it's a visual novel. Now it's a visual novel. How many video games can we fit into one video game? This is the Dugong Hotel. I worked here 12 years ago. It is a five-star hotel with both tradition and a long history. Looks a bit old, yes, but at the time the quality of the blah 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 blah. Oh my god, it's Ace Attorney. Yes, did you have a moment? What is it, manager? Well, a troublesome customer left the reservation. Troublesome customer? Do you know the actress Lois Crawford? She made a reservation at our hotel. Lois Crawford. Lois Crawford. Lois Crawford. She was a leading actress with a long career. Her role as a spy in one of her most famous works, The 42nd Floor, was extremely impressive. She appears to have hit a slight slump as her new movies haven't been doing very well. Lois Crawford. Hotel. Our Dugong Hotel is a luxury hotel with many years of history and tradition. In the past, we had noble staying at, in our accommodations, and many notable films were shot here. Many people seeking the. I'm running out of patience. The manager has spent his entire life at the hotel. <coughs> oh no! <coughs> ah! Uh, he had a lot of knowledge about the etiquette used by the upper class of each country. I have so much congestion. He is very used to servicing those of high rank. Many VIPs sought his services. I've heard that Lois Crawford can be very picky. But we are a very high quality hotel with history and tradition on our side. Uh. Uh. Rumors. Rumors? Today's my 18th birthday with two frowny faces. Happy birthday, Marfie, frowny face. Hope you have a great day, frowny face. Take a look at this. This is... She's famous not only as a chef, but a gourmet. That's a blurb she published in a travel magazine recently. Hmm. Appears to be a description of her travels. It's just her bashing on the hotel she stayed at. Gloria Hotels are the best of the best, and yet she wrote such a scathing review. Bringing it the bad does make a person look more professional. Her writing is mostly like this. Oh my god. I'm kind of... I don't mean to sound mean, but I'm kind of disinterested in what's going on right here. I don't care. Whatever. I don't care. Suppose you can't refuse the reservations. It's true. Gotta satisfy her. Hotel strengths are long history and tradition and high quality service. Making good use of these things. Is your service sweet? Yes, it's sweet. We need clean rooms and service. This is... This is... I'm not a huge fan of this part. <laughs> I'm kind of bored. I'm not. I'm just not good with like visual novel type games because I'm, I'm a bad reader. I'll look into the drinks and amenities she prefers. Okay. Okay. Yeah. I'm sure. Ugh. I'm sure this is the kind of shit of when this when this is made into a video. This is gonna really frustrate people. Be just skipping through the dialogue. I'm just not good at reading and I don't have patience for it. Dude, my hand is really bugging me. I like when I when I like curl my these two fingers that are bothering me. They feel really tight. There actually definitely is something wrong with my hand. I'm gonna call my mom after this stream. There's no, there's no one that can handle such a tricky customer except you, with your long experience with many VIPs. Blee blah blah blah. Blah blah meals. Italian's delicious. Our hotel provides Italian food like a bistro and in a la carte style. We serve pasta or pizza with a simple wine. The chef learned to cook in Naples, and his margarita pizza was good, but didn't really go well with the dinner course. 
I did not. I mean to do that before. Franche. We have fantastic French food at our hotel. It's the pride and joy of the Dukong Hotel. With a Michelin starred head chef at the helm. But you came at the most inconvenient time. Our head chef is in France. Oh. Uh oh. Japanese. Dugong Hotel's Japanese food has never been a strong suit. It only served udon or simple donburi. We've been making exponential progress, however. After we had hired Boncho, we've grown quite dramatically. Boncho is famous for his ability to reinterpret the use of ingredients. And his food was recently featured in an overseas magazine. Wow. Carpet taller or something? Honestly, maybe. He might be our dark horse. Are you ready for? Ready for? Ready for? That means Japanese is likely to be our best choice. <laughs> Boncho hasn't really proven himself yet. Do you think it'll be all right? Yeah, he's awesome. One great drawback is that he doesn't consider the preferences of his customers. Oh, he's creative, but wah wah. Lois Crawford, Lois Crawford, okay. Oh my God, Boncho, are you here? There's Boncho, look at him, he looks so cool. What happened to that hair, man? That's some groovy hair. Ms. Yoshi, what are you doing here? Oh, you're here. That's good. I've come to check on the status of m the manager's request. Look all you want. Just an ordinary Japanese food kitchen. Pancho was a peculiar man. He suddenly appeared one day, handing us a resume and explaining he'd been learning in Japan. All the sushi establishments listed on the resume were top tier, but Pancho never stayed in one place for long. They should have leaned in and gone full fro. Yeah, I would have loved that. He told me that he moved. It. The ball thing is cool, too, though. He, like the fact that he is now a bald man, I feel like really adds to his like very like cool clinical style. He told me that he moved on each time after learning it. Uh, 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 uh. Repracticing? Well, yes. Training means thousands and tens of thousands of attempts. Practice without rest is the only way to produce meaningful results. Okay. <laughs> I heard that you never skip research and practice. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Try servicing a VIP. That's right. We have an important guest who will increase our reputation, or rather, who might send it plummeting into the ground. Her name is Lois Crawford. She's an actress that's infamously hard to please, and also a gourmet reviewer. Whatever. It's been about a year since you joined the Dugong Hotel. Our Japanese food team, which was never very strong, received much attention. Uh. Try to appease. Okay, I get the gist, man. Holy mackerel. Holy smackerel. Holy Mac. Mac slap. He said yes is what you need to know. Oh, God. Sushi. A sushi course offers various kinds of sushi. Buh. Buh. I think it's a sushi course. I'm very familiar with the method. However, don't you think it'll be too ordinary? If we choose to go with this, likely use tuna sushi, pike eel sushi, or olive flounder sushi as the main dish. Olive flounder being in season right now. That would be very impressive, however. <gasps> Alright. Uh, single dish. Though it might be a bit different from the traditional method. I think I could add soup and hors d'oeuvres, sashimi, side dishes, sushi, tempura, and dessert to the course. Damn. As a soup to begin with. Okay. A few minutes later. Yes, I think that'll be fine. <laughs> okay, temporary is next. So shrimp would be the logical choice. Difficult to create any impact of shrimp. We've kept everything pretty normal so far. So this is where we add a little spice. I've been researching this very topic. How's something like this sound? Shark. I'm thinking of a dish that uses a shark head. What? A shark? Can sharks be eaten? Sharks are very tasty fish. This is the time of year when they grow fat, boosting the flavor. The meat in the cheeks is per in particular has a lovely chewy texture, which reminds you of both ordinary meat and fish. So it's not ordinary meat. Sorry, that was stupid. Sharks do exotic of an ingredient. Uh, especially considering this is Lois Crawford. Good food will impress anyone. Anyone who takes a bite will recognize the food for what it is. That it is the best possible food that can be found around here in the current season. Um, I'll give it some thought. I'm not sure if it'll be okay. This is not a good idea. Mm, uh... Okay, he's going with the shrimp tempura. All right, Lois Crawford. This way, Miss Crawford. Thank you. This is the chef who will be preparing your food today, Boncho. 
Mm, he's younger than I expected. I was hoping for a slightly more experienced chef. Oh my, tight-lipped, are we? Perhaps my looks leave you at a loss for words. Haha, <laughs> seems a little tense. He's actually quite a skilled chef, I assure you. I'm looking forward to the food, then. I remember the service here being quite alright for an old hotel. I liked the carpet and the paintings on the walls as well. Furnishings at Gloria Hotel have a kitsch quality to them that I don't like. But to think there's no gym, that's a bit of a shocker. I need to exercise daily to maintain my figure. It was our intention that you stay as restful as possible. Everyone has their preferred way of resting. Well, the bathing facilities were good, so I'll content myself with that. So, what's for dinner? A Japanese course meal. Here's the course menu. The first dishes are... Uh, this is a steamed dish composed of grilled snapper and roe, which was then steamed... We already established that. Garnished with ground yam. The soup features the rich flavor of fish. Hmm, is that a Japanese soup? No. Yeah. <laughs> it's got a bland flavor, coupled with a spicy scent. Quite interesting. That is the flavor of the shichimi. There's a tiny bit of flavoring produced by a condiment made from seven different spices. And the next dish is... Oh my god. Jesus. So, the tempura and dessert are left. What's the tempura? Don't tell me it's shrimp, the sort that's commonly served with rice. Ah. <sighs> the dessert's no doubt the usual fruit. I suppose I've tasted basically everything. You botched it! How do you like it? Are you happy with our Japanese food? Well, it's about as good as I expected it to be, I suppose. I suppose I could come here to eat every now and then, but why bother coming to a hotel to eat food that's quite average? <laughs> We're fucked. Even so, I'm sure our food is better than that of most other restaurants. The snapper soup or something was pretty interesting, but that's it. It was just a fishy soup with a spicy aftertaste. Think you added sticky yam on top? Ugh, I don't really like the texture. Whoops. Ignorant to that fact, we served you Japanese. My mistake. Please accept my apologies. Whatever. It wasn't that good, but it was healthy at least. This hotel doesn't even have a gym, so I suppose the food should be healthy at the very least. <laughs> Uh-oh. Is the incident that he just, like, goes in on her? Uh, may I have a word? Boncho! Let me introduce myself again. I'm the master chef who works here, Boncho. Get her, Boncho! Get her! I'm not much of a speaker, so I've been listening quietly. I find it impossible to maintain my silence now, however. Oh my, do you have something to tell me? Apparently you're supposed to have better food than anywhere else, right? Now, now, Boncho, Miss Lois here is just... It's most definitely my fault for failing to provide food that satisfies you. Satisfies. Good job. No, that is how you say it. Oh my god, I said satisfies you, and then I thought about it. I was like, ah, you misspoke, dumbass. And now I'm thinking about it. And, uh, yeah, that's the word, satisfy. I don't know why, when I said satisfies, I was like, no, it's satisfy. Okay, whatever. Will you not give me a chance to make up for my mistake? What? Oh. Well, gosh, I'm a very busy woman. What you witnessed today aren't my real skills. I'll serve you food that can objectively be called good. Pancho, you can't be talking about... Hmm, so you're saying you have something else you think will satisfy me. Alright, I'll wait. But remember, my time is valuable. Your food had better be amazing. Here we go. Here we go. Do it. All done. Yo, this is whole roasted shark head. Oh my god! This is... You fried the whole head? It is an amazing dish. The meat in the cheeks hasn't been cut out. I chose to fry the head whole to preserve the supple texture. You'll never taste something like this anywhere else. It's a high quality dish made using the best possible ingredient. Get that out of my sight! How dare you call this food? Whatever. What are you saying? Take just a bite. I guarantee you'll be transported to heaven. I'm not happy about this. This is what service is this what service is like at the Dugong Hotel? It's all my fault. I apologize. Now, Boncho, Yoshi, you apologize as well. I'm sorry, Miss Lois. Should have been more vigilant. Looks are not all there is to food. Why do you refuse to even try it, Miss Lois? Yeah. Go at her. I find this highly unpleasant. Is this some kind of hidden camera prank or punishment? You'll pay for treating me this way. Don't think I'll just let you get away with it. I'm leaving. Cancel my suite. Charge me a cancellation fee if you wish. I don't care. Boo. Boo. That is not that scandalous. After that, Boncho quit his job at the hotel on the left, saying he needed a train. What do you mean you need a train? The 
problem wasn't that your food didn't taste good. It was just that she wouldn't try it. It's my belief it wasn't so much the cooking itself as the ingredients and cooking methods that he researched. Oh, never mind. That makes sense. So he's just trying to really knock her socks off. I admire him a little. A little. I admire him a little for not giving up on the belief that he's going on the right path. I thought it was going to say he's going to heaven. Suppose it was this stubborn side of him that allowed him to attain his current level of skill. Working with you now, he even started social media. I feel something has changed about him, and I like it. I think you're good for him. Like a nutritious like a nutritious meal. Please continue to get along. I'll do my best to help Boncho focus on his cooking. Okay. Everyone is so mean to Dave. I don't know why that just occurred to me when no it was me or just there, but it's true. Picture you took was well received. Great to hear that. Here my superiors want to assign me another task. If I bring them a picture as nice as the previous ones. I have an offer for you. Do you want to join me and take a picture that will stand the test of time? What are you planning to take a picture of? You know about manta rays? Of course. They're one of the largest of their kind. I've seen one of those majestic creatures firsthand. Good. I'm planning to take a picture of them. What do you think? All right, I'm sold. But, but, they are nocturnal, so we need to move at night, and we need some lure to attract them. Sir, I will prepare my equipment. Could you find a lure in the meantime? Sure. Sure, you'll figure that out in no time. What do they feed on? Ellie is the best. Should I give her a call? I haven't talked to Ellie in a while. I would love to give her a call. Hi, Dr. Bacon. Oh, Dave! You weren't around yesterday, so I was a bit worried. Couldn't get in touch with you via radio, either. I was at the Sea People Village yesterday. You you what? What happened? Well, you see. Bye, 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 bye. Uh-huh. Yeah, this guy sucks. Neat. Neat. I don't like Udo's mouth. That's fine. <laughs> no skin off my back. I see. I envy you. I do. What a lucky experience. I'm not sure I can help, but it's clear they have problems to deal with. Why don't you go talk with the residents first? I'd love to go as well, but... As you said, only one person can use the sea people mirror. What a pity. <laughs> An unexpected turn of events. Cobra shop! <laughs> I don't want to go to the cobra shop. Use the sea people mirror. I don't want to go to the cobra shop. Okay, well, there's the sea people mirror. Uh, you can use the mirror. Oh my god! The fish in the farm is they multiplied. I'm not doing the voice anymore because it tore up my throat. Hurry on over to the fish farm. Okay. This is starting to get overwhelming. <laughs> I'm checking Twitter real fast. I need to know if any baseball stuff happened. I simply must. I just want to make sure I'm not missing any baseball news. I don't think I'm missing any baseball news. Nothing has happened. Nothing has happened. God, my hand, man. Mark the sexes with new fish with hearts. Go and see for yourself. Okay. Wow. Mysteries of nature never cease to amaze me. I'll tell you once the eggs hatch. Ah. Cute, cute, cute. You have a son? Oh. Well, he has a son. 
Okay. Cool. I will not really be using this feature. <laughs> I will forget. <laughs> See you around, Otto. Let's go to boat. I thought it was no skin off my teeth. I think that's... Isn't it no skin off my nose? Well, I've not heard it either. There's no skin off my teeth is... I think that's by the skin of your teeth is the phrase. Remember to take your meds. Okay. Um, no skin off my teeth. No skin off my back. Yeah, that's what I said. A dur. Okay, let's see here. <laughs> call. Uh, I need to call Ellie. Oh, how's it going? What a man, Tracy! <laughs> now! Tell me now! Tell me now! Tell me now! 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 Do you know Manta Ray's feet on? Mm. I know what Manta Ray's eat. Oh, really? They feed on plankton at night. Drop something that lures glowing plankton at night and they'll come. And you will need five kelp to lure plankton. Huh? It's made of kelp? Not necessarily, but they will work too. Just bring me some. See, this is what I mean. I feel like the dialogue was translated. Because, like, there are a lot of, like, dangling pronouns here that I don't really know what we're talking about. And also what is not necessarily... A... I don't know. Oh! You got it? Oh, I did it already. Now I put this here. Woohoo! Got some eco points. Hey, this has nothing to do with the lore. Oh, uh, don't be disappointed yet. Ta-da! The lore capsule. Oh. Just drive this lure and you will lure all the plankton in the area. It's made of quality ingredients. Goodbye, then. You got the lure now. I must tell Udo about it. Ah, this must be the lure from manta rays. My mouth is watering. Okay, dude. I don't know what we're talking about. I'm kidding. Anyways, I need to be prepared to take pictures at night. I'll call you when I'm ready. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's do our eco-watcher for... There goes my damn head. This thing's battery life is eight fucking seconds. Okay. <laughs> Let me do my cord. I guess. <sighs> is he kidding? Definitely not. Okay. Uh, starfish. 20 research points. 40. Wow. And that's a level up. We got the eco poison resist bracelet. 30 more research points. We need 580? Bruh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> I don't know what I I'm on a huge bruh kick, and I'm trying to, like, break out of it, and I'm having trouble. I... I can't stop. I My friends keep commenting on it because it's true that I've just been on this really bizarre, like, bruh streak. What's next? The gemstone bracelet. Um, I need one more fossil. I need to remove jellyfish. Titan trigger fish. Uh, find more starfish. Shells. Plants. Okay. Lots to do. Pretty much just grab, like, everything. We'll get there eventually. It'll just take a good while. Cooksta! Boncho is starting to get some fat legs. We got 541. Dr. Bacon still gets, has zero, zero clout. Maki Maki, especially three likes. Jesus. I think I'm a little drunk. Okay. Laller. A thousand. Amazing. Okay. Uh... We're gaining followers. We're gaining followers. Slowly but surely. Uh, okay. I'm going to save up my money uh, to hire someone tonight. Okay. Let's go. I need to build up trust with the sea people, which I'll do later. I'll use the, the mirror uh, for the afternoon slot. 
And then for the morning slot right now, I'm just going to grab some fish, do some eco-watcher stuff. Look at all these little babies. So many new kinds of fish. Shell. Yay! Sea urchin sushi. Hi. White leg shrimp. La 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 la. Who's your favorite Disney princess? I've never been much of a Disney guy, so I don't. I'm not like very familiar with them. Um. Probably Mulan. Mulan's cool as hell. Okay, y'all are the cool kind of jellyfish. So we're chill. Oh, my dash is gone. Oh, I can only have one thing equipped at once. Or two things. I have gun damage and I have increased dash speed. I'm going to swap out the gun damage one. Oh, I can't right now. Okay. Well, when I get a chance, I'm going to swap that one out for the, the one that gives me a little dash. Because that's super handy. Oh, I want those fish. The blue ones. Okay. Playing Among Us while keeping an eye on chat. People are beefing hardcore. It's insane. In, in Among Us or in the chat? <laughs> I hope in Among Us. Oh, the black ones. I remember uh, upgrading these ones a bit too. The black and white snapper. I don't see much white, but in Among Us I see. Okay. I need to kill that. Let's not do shark tonight. We've been doing shark like every night. I don't know if it's wise or not that I'm doing that. La 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 la. I'm going bees that start before I join the lobby. Oh my god. That's wild. I think we have a lot of extra fish. So I think maybe it might be smart to... Oh, there it goes. I'm not getting that. I think maybe it might be smart to sell all of the spare fish that we're probably not going to cook with, but not sell any of the extra ingredients that we might need for, like, cool dishes. Because we're kind of, like, just specializing in, in a few fish right now, which I think makes the most sense with the upgrade system being the way it is. So... I think that... That would make sense. What is this? It's a bowl. Uh, I think it might make sense to... Because we have like, a lot of extra fish that we are not using. We can make some extra cash off those guys. The pink seashells are, are really the problem, it turns out. Upgrade kit would be faller. Yay! Some more oxygen. Wood. Middle. Okay, I got all the kelp I need for Eco Watcher. What else do I need? Um, I need is this seaweed, I guess. Lots of shells. Lots of starfish. We're done with that. Uh, the jellyfish, I'm just having trouble finding. Leg bone, please. 
We've gotten a lot of feet and heads in a row. God damn it. Eventually it's gonna have to happen. This is kelp, unfortunately. Disassemble. I'll grab whatever this is. It's just rocks. Oh, it's iron ore. What are you? Sorry. I meant to switch. Also, there's some Trevally up there if you want to grab those. Okay, this thing's tough and I'm really intrigued. Shot it once, harpooned it once. Harpooned it twice and it's still not down, so I could sh I could stand to shoot it twice before harpooning. It's even paralyzed. Oh my god, dude. Please. That is really hard. Especially because that's my carpal tunneled finger. the hell oh it's the kind that you carve off of giant trevally let's get some of that there's another one yeah i can shoot it like three times Okay, so that's what we'll try serving up today, and we'll see how that goes. It's a it's rank four, so should be pretty swag. A pink shell, whatever. See so. That's what we need. Kajime. Okay, I've already got plenty of fish to serve up, so I think I'm good. Soy sauce. We're already squared on blue seashells. We need a lot of pink ones. The pink ones are so much rarer for some reason. What was that up there? Bullets or something? I don't want to go all the way so far. We're not going to do much on this expedition. because I'm, ex I'm excited to get back to the like actual cooking part of the game where you're serving up customers. I also want to find more of these... Um, Whatever the hell. These guys. The little boys. Cleon. Are there just gonna be two every day that like spawn in the same spot? Maybe not. Cleon. Oh. Okay. I didn't realize this way was even here. Oh, more Trevally. I'd like to, I'd like you. I'm faster than you. Yeah. That's what happens. Oh. It's dead. There we go. Uh, okay. Um, I guess we'll keep looking for Cleones. We have three. We need five. I don't know if this game has like spawn rates, like things will respawn if you catch a lot of things or kill a lot of things or something. Or if just every day there's like a set number of things that is then exhausted and then you're done. Like I don't know if I just hang around here for a really long time if more of those things will spawn. Or if I'm kind of just done. There's one. Please don't. Need one more. I stuck around more. Uh oh. Uh oh. 
this is a huge clean. Yeah. We're gonna go investigate. The oh, baby. All right, this is about to spawn some kind of boss, so let's switch to our gun. And uh, let's get it. Uh, let's get it. What up? Oh my god. Game over. What? What is this place? I don't know. It looks like every other place. Hi! Oh no. It's such a big Cleon. Uh oh. Alright. Let's tuzzle. Probably won't get rid of that fight. Let's defeat it first. Is the tip of its tail weak or do I just need to shoot it? And that's it. Okay. The head, probably. Yeah. Head is the name of the game. I missed. I can't be doing that, dude. I have a very limited number of shots. Oh, I, I like glitched out there for a second for some reason. Oh. I only have two bullets left. What are bullets? Yipes, bro. Oh my god, oh my god. Switch, use it. Okay, I don't know why it was not. Oh, well, I, I wanted that. I'm just having my dash bracelet, dude. I did not mean to unequip it. Oh. Wow, that was a point blank final shot. I did it. That's a lot of white. This is bright. Phew, what a monster. Oh, monster. I captured five children. And then, okay. Well. What up? I got the queen tentacle. Oh, my God. That's, is that the kid? Holy frick. It's Furumaki. Let's take it back up. Maybe the Cleone queen killed her father. <laughs> All right, well, I guess I'll leave now. Um, what are my goals? Meet my kids at sushi bar and build up trust. Yeah, we're done. Okay. Is there an emergency call down here? That would be really convenient. I think there's one down, down bottom right. Yep. Yes, sir, Bob. Adios. Maybe that was her father. That's true. That's a good point. We did it. We obtained 49 things. Which is a new best, apparently. Boncho loved it. And the fish loved each other. Let me turn to upgrade your equipment. You keep saying that. But I'm saving up. Because I want to hire someone awesome. Twenty research points. Okay, I need a Titan Trigger Fish and the Great Barracuda. Need those two: Kajime, Brown Shell, Pink Shell, Starfish, Fried Egg Jellyfish, and the Leg Bone. Okay. We need five hundred and eighty of these eco points, man. God damn. That's a lot. Ah! That's a lot of eco points. Bruh. Okay. Let's um let's take a pit stop at the at the the shop and let's let's go through and sell some of our ingredients. Like our fish that we're not gonna use. Oh, also we can talk to Monkey. Here, a Cleon like you asked. It's so beautiful. Thank you, Dave. And I found this. Huh? Is that a photo of me? There's a huge Cleon. I found this in its home. I feel like I keep saying this thing's name. I need to know how to pronounce it. It's 
small floating floating sea slug. They're so cool. Clyoni? Is it Clyoni? This person says Cleone. Clyoni. I'll say Cleone. There's a huge Cleone. Found this in its home. There's a button on the back. I'll try pressing it. Oh my god, it, it's Papa! I don't know why the hell it was there. Maki, it's your father. Watching this, then I probably failed my expedition. Whoops, couldn't really take care of you with my bussy, bussy schedule. My greed for more work has turned me into an irresponsible father. You haven't been able to make many friends because we kept moving around because of my work. Even so, I want you to forgive me <laughs> okay. for being a terrible father and live a confident life. And your dream of becoming a chef, I hope it comes true. I'll keep watching you from afar so you don't ever lose your smile. Static. Sounds good. Uh, it seems to have cut off. Don't be too upset. <laughs> Thanks, Dave. Seems your father really loved you, Maki. Please let me work here. Sure. What? So suddenly? Yes, my father wouldn't like to see me so lethargic and sad. I want to show him that I'm doing fine and working hard. And as you showed concern for me and helped me, I'd like to help you as well. Uh, Boncho, what do you think? Hmm, what a spirited child. I like her. You can start working here today, but you won't be getting any special treatment. Yes, okay. I love Boncho. I will work hard to learn and become an amazing chef. Girl, your father's probably dead. Yeah, I don't... Okay. Boncho Sushi. As staff, but like for what? As cooking, I guess? Hold on. She's not listed, so I guess she's like special. Oh, waiting room. One hundred cooking. Oh, I can't get her in the kitchen yet. Until I get gold. Well, we're almost there. Okay, let's hire somebody. Oh, we don't have enough for Yone, but she's a hundred and fifty-five cooking. Honestly, I'd prefer Billy because he's such a great server. He doesn't have much appeal. What does procure mean? I don't understand. Maybe we'd get Billy because we have... Okay, hold on. Hold on. Because we have... Does waiting room mean that they're working in the waiting room? Or does waiting room mean that they aren't actually on on tap yet and I need to make a spot for them. James has 200 cooking, so that's, you know, James is staying. Um, for the kitchen, cooking is the only stat that matters. Yes, I figure. But like, what about for, for waiting? I'm assuming procure and appeal matter. You can't have anyone else in the kitchen yet. I know this, but I'm saying, like, should I leave a spot available for the other person? Or should I go ahead and hire this person, have them wait, like, for now, and then I, once I have a spot open, I can move them in there? Because, like, 155 cooking is pretty nuts at level one. And this, but Billy is a great server. Do you, do you see what I mean? Like, I don't know if these, like, scripted employees... Like, she's, like, a story character. So I don't know if it'll just always make a spot for her and you don't actually have to put her in one of your slots. Or if having her in waiting room means, like, she's not doing anything yet. And I need to, like, get her in the kitchen. Let's just be safe and hire, hire Billy, I guess. Plus, I like Billy. I like his, his face tat. It's funny. 
Yoni's cute. I know, I'm just confused. Can't, yeah, I just don't really get get it. I can have Maki do serving, but she doesn't want to do that. She must be a chef. Okay, so I do need to employ her somehow. Okay, so then Maki is going to get our second kitchen slot, I guess. Um, so I guess we hire Billy. And, and Billy goes here. I guess. None of these people are appealing. I guess not. I'm I'm just not very... I'm really confused about this mechanic. Like, all the ways it works. If they're in the waiting room, they're waiting to be assigned so they don't work, but you can send them for ingredients like salt. Oh. I'm really just confused. Everyone's saying I need to hire this person, but I don't know why. Because then I feel like we're going to have literally too many cooks in the kitchen. Because we've got James with 200. We don't even have a second spot yet. And when we do, I thought our I thought our, uh, our girl's gone in there. Maki. So then we'll have three people for one cooking slot eventually two and then still only just one person serving she has pink hair and we like her okay cool well i don't really know what to do so i'm just gonna hire billy oops she's also whack expensive jesus i didn't even notice the price oh my god she costs like triple what billy does Oh, procure is if you send them out to get stuff. Oh. Okay. Hold on. So you can send them out. So you can send them out to get stuff. And then I guess that's what procure means. I don't know when appeal comes into the... Maybe if you just have more people, like servers working, you have a higher appeal, you'll get more followers. And you'll get more, like, attention. So I guess... So for a second, I was going to say, then that could work fine because then we could have Yone because she has great pr procure as well. She could be in the waiting room and we could send her to go get stuff and she'd do a great job at that. And then if we have our spot open in the kitchen, she has a great cooking stat, which is great. But then we'd still only have one person helping me wait, like wait tables. And she costs $1,400 when no one else is even close. So, people try for serving. Yeah, that's I, I figured that much. Seems like a good server is more valuable. Now, that's what I figured. But then everyone started whining. I'm gonna do it. I feel like it makes way more sense to get a server. Than to drop literally everything we have on someone just to put them in the waiting room. <laughs> so we're doing Billy. Okay. We're going to have Billy. Billy has terrible appeal, but whatever. I don't see that. His tattoo is sick. But he's a great server, so he'll do a great job. We hired Billy. Okay. And then we'll put Billy in here. And then, Billy, let's train you up, my friend. Okay, Billy, you're amazing. So, Billy is very good at, at, at serving people. 
Maybe it's blood and not a tattoo. That would be rad. He's got an idea. What does that mean? Oh, that just means he's like about to learn a skill. If he tip master always gets tips, dude. Done. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. That'll be very helpful. All right. Well, we have that done. We can research something. We could do all three of them. Neat. Okay, close. All right, let's go back to the boat. And let's build up trust with the sea people or whatever. I'm gonna drink some water. Oh, oh my god, I'm like out of water. Okay, well, it is 442, so... We'll do, uh, this will be our last day. All right, we'll dive. We'll go to the sea people thing, we'll do that, and then we'll set our menu, sell extra fish, do a shift of work, and then we'll end stream. Okay. Oh, wait! Shit! The mirror. Whoops. Okay, well. We'll do that another day, I guess. I can't get out without it skipping the whole day, can I? Farts. I forgot that I can't go in the water. Okay, well then I guess we just... Hmm. Well then. we. Can, I guess we just go. Naturally. Ah, oh, but then I'm gonna get crushed by the depths. It's a whale. Damn. Howdy, friend. How goes it? Don't eat me. Thanks. Okay. <laughs> Tita has something to say. I should record its cries and ask Ellie about it. See you around. Okay. Um, oh, pink seashell. Hooray. These are so rare for no reason. Oh, I need to kill those things. The trigger fish. You need to die, my friend. You know, it's one out of three. Well, you only need to kill three of them. That's nice. Scooter. Okay. Uh, maybe we just don't go to the Sea People Village. We can do it another day. We'll just have another day of, like, wandering about. We don't need to play each day perfectly. That's fine. Cause if I go, I'd like to use the mirror. I don't want to go all the way back there. Let's we'll say on foot. On fin. On flipper. Pink seashell. You be. It was a brown one, I think. Whoops. Oh, my God. Can I? Jesus. I need to get my dash thing back. Like, this game is like an unplayable without it now that I have experienced it. Like, I need it back.
Down I go. Ooh, different area this time. Got lots of these guys. I could upgrade a hell of a lot of, oh. White Trevally type beats with all these cool guys. Okay, with all these cool guys. That literally went into the sprite, but whatever. What the hell? Why, why, what it? Okay, I don't know what that was about. Currents. Let me grab that frag. Sesame seed. I'm not finding any Kajime, which I need. So that's not great. Fragment. Oh. Yay. I'm just scavenging for all the eco watcher shit. Alright, I'll go down. F it. I'm not forgetting about any little tasks, am I? Yeah, it's just build up trust to see people, which I will not be doing today. Squid. Oh, that thing again. A starfish. Lost to see. Yep. No. No. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, that's right. Top off my meter. Still no Kajime. I want this. Thanks. Pink seashell. Yes. I have so much trouble finding those for some reason. things. I'm going to keep killing these because I want to like really upgrade. You're slowing down, Goopball. Yep. Yep. Running out of room, but who cares? We got some more Trevally. Oh, hit a rock. I don't know why it went right there. Starfish. I don't want to waste my inventory space on you. Oh no. Okay, fine. I'm done. Toodle Town. All done. Yay. I got whale cry. Get things ready at Boncho Sushi.
Anything for Eco Watcher to turn in? Nope. Um, okay. Guess I'll go. To Sushi Town. Alright, we gotta... Sell our extra fish. And then everything else would be standard. Oh, it's this dude. Hello, Otto. How goes it, my friend? What? Sea people? It's hard to believe that something I've only heard of in legend is real. There's good beer in that area. I wouldn't mind trying some. I don't think there will be drinks underwater. Oh, he's like belligerent. Hello. It's the VIP. It's Michael Bang, the master. Oh, it's Michael Bang. Looks like this is the only place to eat. This is what I don't like about remote areas. This decrepit place can't possibly make sushi that'll inspire me. I'll just have to fill my belly with what I can get. Oh, what a rude customer. What do you want? Let me introduce myself. I'm the movie director, Michael Bang. Wait, didn't you direct Robot Samurai? Huh, <laughs> looks like your eyes are functional. Yes, I'm the great action film director. Michael Bang. Can't believe he's talking like that about himself. I'm filming my new movie, The Stone, around these parts, and I can't seem to get the ending scene right. I think I might find new inspiration with food that'll clear up my head. Doesn't seem likely I'll find anything here. I'm leaving. Wait! Robot Samurai was an amazing movie. I watched it multiple times and it was moved every time. All I can remember is explosions. You can make another such great movie through my food. I'd be willing to cook for you. Oh, so you're a fan. I'm grateful, but can you pull it off? Yes. I've got high standards when it comes to sushi. The rice they use in these parts is terrible, by the way. That's why we use the best rice we can find in this region. Give me three days. I'll prepare food that'll make your head all but explode with inspiration. Okay, so I have three days to get Boncho what he probably wants. Boncho, do you have a plan? Mmm, cooking is an art form. I know well the pain of an... Oof. What does that even mean? Auteur. I'll prepare food that'll inspire him. However, as you said, bah. If I was me, the ingredient has limits. Bah. Bah. Rice. Otto, give me a day. Rice. Rice. Okay, and then I just need to find all those things he wants me to find. All right, see you, Otto. Thanks for coming, man. Michael Bang. Michael Bang. Michael Bang. I forgot about to do. Look at all these things I've done. I'm awesome. Just need these. Oh, call Ellie about the world cry. Okay, let's go ahead and call Ellie. Ellie, well, 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 well. Oh, it lost its babies. Okay. Finding the baby whale. Epic. Okay. Um. Neat. Okay. Um. Back to work. I can't technically afford training, but I need to save up for upgrades. Okay, ingredients. Let's sell some stuff that we don't need. The white tip reef shark head is baller as hell. Usable for whole roasted shark head, but not much else. So we're gonna sell all of those. I don't have any. Why are you telling me this then? Um, I've got one cookie cutter shark. I'll sell that. Uh, we got four sea urchins. We should probably keep those. Five of the salmon snail fish. Sell that. Uh, the moray eel we're done with. All of this is being used. That's our bread and butter right there. 
Uh, the chamber Nautilus, who cares? Um, white leg shrimp, I don't care. We just have a lot of white tip shark, a lot of giant trevally. fish we have. I'm never using these. Okay. That's right. I killed that whole like family worth of these. Okay. That's fine for now. Um, now. Let's set our menu here. We've got tons of tiger shark meat. How much do we need to enhance? We need 22. So... Maybe it actually would be better to to save up. Wow, 550 for that. Look at that. Oh my god. That'll make us fast stack. Okay, cool. Um White Trevally sushi right now is level 7, and that's awesome. Let's we can't enhance it. We can't enhance either of these. This is level five. We can enhance this. Uh, let's just do... We get some more Trevally. We have 33 out of 34. We'll do like... Do not make 33 of those. Oh my god. Six. And then we'll do... Six. We have one kelp for this, but only only the one kelp. We'll serve one. <laughs> okay. That's uh 12. Oh, I didn't realize this makes 10 servings. Oh my god. We're fine. We just made way too much food. Shit. I didn't I thought this was only one serving cuz it was worth so much. Whoops. Okay. Well. Now I'm embarrassed. All right. Well, let's uh Let's go. We have like way too much food. I need to find three coral trout and three white rice for Michael Bang. Do I want tea or something? Cause I can do that for you, lickety split your. That is as perfect as perfect gets. Okay, you guys have got it. Unlock. Good job. Perfect again. That sound doesn't sounds like a bad noise, so I always think that they hated it whenever that sound plays. Okay, the beer I really struggle with, but I've gotta learn. Runs about twenty percent of it is foam. Good again. How do you do it? Okay, I'm just gonna leave that to her. Because I, I don't know how to do it. There's so many dishes to clean. Shh, stop. They've got it on lock. Oh yeah, she's got it. Okay, we actually did prepare enough food. Now more people are coming. So we actually did get a good amount of stuff. Yay! Someone see my belly expanded? I do not like that phrasing very much at all. Okay, so right around 20 is actually like a good amount to prepare right now. That's gotta be a new best for profit by a lot. Yeah. 5,472 in profit. Look at this graph. This, this Cleone Queen soup is insane. Oh my god. I can increase my rating. They loved the soup. 
<laughs> Dog, they loved the soup. Auto. Blah, 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 blah. blah. Oh my god, he's making me come back to the worm. I need to save and quit. Oh my god, there's another mechanic, y'all. New mechanic. Farming. Now we're farming. <laughs> oh my god. This is insane. Mufasa's death in Lion King made me sob until I threw up. I'm sorry. Farm now app. <laughs> wow. Okay. Put out the weeds and manage the soil health rating. Done. Like the weeds out like that and I'll do the watering. Huh. I'll go grow rice for you in the farm. You don't visit often enough. Soil nutrient may drop. Okay, well, I'm gonna go ahead and increase my cook star ranking. Gold. Gold rank. And now we can have another person in the kitchen. Yep. 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 Awesome. We got new recipes. Look at all these. Super cool. That's worth a lot. Sea grapes. Right, an extra menu slot, which I'm never going to use. Extra kitchen staff. More wasabi. And more interior. Huh. Yeah, what, what other what, what stuff can we get for interior? Brick is pretty cool. Lightwood is really, really cool, and I'm buying it. Nice. Okay, what other stuff can we do? Chair. Antique bar chair is lovely. We're going to do this one. Sushi place looking nice. Okay, ceiling. I like the redwood a lot. 400? Yep. <laughs> this is where all of the money's going. Oh, I like this speaker. We only have the one kind of lighting. There's a lot. There's a lot. Okay. Okay. This is too much. All right. Let's save and quit. Save and return to title. Dave the Diver, y'all. That was a lot. That This game has a lot of mechanics. But I'm having a great time. Um, yeah. That was a good time. Right around exactly three hours fun times were had by all uh i'll be back on friday for no i won't no i won't that's right i actually have a uh medical appointment um oh wait shoot hold on okay we're fine uh, i have a medical appointment um on Friday at exactly stream time. So I can't stream on Friday. So I'll be back on Sunday. Christmas Eve. Oh my god. I'll be back on Christmas Eve. For some toy with you. Or maybe before that, because now that I'm I've got a month at home, I might go back to four streams a week while I'm here. Cause I'll have less stuff going on. And that way I can get more content out. So I probably will be switching back to four streams a week. So I'll work on that. I uh, will let y'all know if that's the case. I'll make another graphic for it. Uh, but thanks for coming. That was a great time. And I'll see you around. Uh, babies. Sweet babies. Mwah. Huge kiss.